Hi everyone, welcome to Wedraw Studio. Today, we are going to talk about vanadinite. So now let's get straight to it. Vanadinite is a mineral that belongs to the apatite group of phosphates. It is one of the main industrial ores of the metal vanadium and a minor source of lead. The name vanadinite derives from vanadium, as the mineral presents a high concentration of this chemical element. It was first discovered in 1801 in Zimapan, Hidalgo, Mexico. Did you know that vanadinite formed as a secondary mineral in the zones of lead and lead zinc deposits? The primary lead minerals undergo alteration and oxidation processes, turning into vanadinite. Vanadinite is found in various parts of the world, and Morocco is famous for its exceptional vanadinite specimens, particularly from the Mibladin and Tuisip mining districts. Some other localities of vanadinite deposits include United States, Mexico, Spain, South Africa, Namibia, Austria, and Australia. The vibrant hue of bright red, orange red, or brownish red of vanadinite is due to the presence of vanadium within its crystal structure. They may also appear gray, brown, yellow or even colorless in some instances. Vanadinite exhibits a resinous to subadamantine luster, giving it a shiny and sometimes slightly glassy appearance. The crystals can be transparent to translucent, allowing some light to pass through. Vanadinite crystallizes in the hexagonal crystal system, forming hexagonal prismatic or barrel-shaped crystals. It does not exhibit cleavage, and its fracture is typically uneven to conchoidal. Did you know that vanadinite is known to exhibit twinning, where two or more crystals grow together to share a common plane? The twinning patterns can create intricate and interesting crystal forms. Vanadinite is a relatively soft and brittle mineral with a Mohs hardness of 3 to 4. It can scratch glass, but is softer than many common minerals such as quartz. Due to their delicate nature, extracting vanadinite specimens from mines can be quite challenging. Miners need to take extra care to avoid damaging the crystals during the extraction process. When scratched on a porcelain streak plate, vanadinite leaves a white to pale yellow streak. It is slightly soluble in water, but is relatively insoluble in most common solvents. Did you know that vanadinite is highly sought after by mineral collectors and enthusiasts for its vibrant color, attractive crystal formations, and unique hexagonal prismatic crystals? Fine vanadinite specimens are often showcased in mineral museums and private collections around the world. Vanadinite is one of the primary industrial sources of vanadium, an important alloying element in high-strength steel. The addition of vanadium significantly enhances its strength, toughness, and resistance to wear. Meanwhile, a titanium alloy containing 4% vanadium and 6% aluminum has been used extensively for blades, discs and casings of the compressors in many aero engine gas turbine. Vanadium redox flow batteries are rechargeable batteries that use vanadium ions in different oxidation states to store and release electrical energy. They are known for their long cycle life. Vanadium compounds, such as vanadium pentoxide, serve as catalysts in various chemical processes, such as in the production of sulfuric acid and phthalic anhydride. They are also used as pigments to provide a range of colors in the ceramics industry. The oxides can either be used directly or in combination with tin oxide to give an opaque yellow. Some individuals believe that vanadinite possesses metaphysical properties and healing energies. It is thought to enhance focus, creativity, and determination. Bear in mind that vanadinite is considered toxic as it contains lead. The mineral should be handled with caution to avoid exposure to lead dust or ingestion. Well, that's all for today and thanks for watching. If you like our video, please click the like and subscribe button below. We'll see you in the next video.